Electric eels are not really eels. They are actually Ostariophysian, but have a strong physical resemblance to true eels. An electric eel is mostly tail. The internal organs are compressed into the anterior front one slash fifth of the body. And the rest of the fish consists of the long electricity producing tail. The tail contains the electric organ sacs organ hunter's organ and main organ. Extending down the entire tail region is an elongated anal fin. There are no dorsal or pelvic fins. An adult eel can reach any size from 6 to 9 feet in length and weigh up to 60 pounds. It is cylindrical in shape with a slightly flattened head and large mouth. They do have gills though it is not their primary source of oxygen intake. A thick slimy skin covers the entire body. The skin is used as a protective layer often from their own electrical current that is produced. Electric eels range from grey to brownish black in color with some yellowish coloration on the underside of the body. And have tiny scales. Electric eels do not have teeth enabling them to swallow their prey easier. The eyes are tiny and as this fish ages, its vision diminishes the main and hunter's organs are the high voltage producers. Used for protection fight reflexes and stunning prey. The sex organ is capable only of producing low voltage pulses. Its purpose is mainly electrocommunication and navigation. Electric organs are made up of cells called electrolytes. Some scientists believe these cells are derivative of a muscle cell since nerve cells synapse onto them and they behave much like a muscle cell postsynaptically. However they are unlike muscle cells in that they don't contract. Flat and disc-like. The electrocytes are stacked in a sequence with the head as the positive pole and the tail as the negative pole. Each electrocyte generates